month, we go around town and highlight one city in our area. That's right. We have so many unique communities all around us, but today we wanted to see what makes the city of Rancho Cordova one of Sacramento Valley's most unique cities. Our Marcus Allen joins us now live this morning, March. Mark, as you know, Rancho Cordova, very diverse city, and you've spent a lot of time there as well. Super diverse. Uh, right now, we can't ignore the fact that we have our dream home that somebody is going to win for $100, so checking it out, acting like I'm one of the cool kids in the kitchen. But I want to talk about the city overall. I have long loved it, and Rancho Cordova just keeps getting better and better. Um, the fastest way to my heart for a city is food, and I know I'm not alone. Take a look at this amazing restaurant that's currently the talk of the town in Rancho Cordova. My friends have told me about it. I finally checked it out. It is amazing. I love Filipino food. It's been open since 2022. Fiesta Filipino. Philippines. It's right off of Folsom Boulevard and Olsom Drive. We caught up with some of the chefs and they tell us it was their dream to open specifically this restaurant, specifically to bring a taste of home to the area. Take a look. Fiesta Philippines is unlike any other restaurant in Sacramento counties. It's, a, it's like a meeting place to learn and enjoy Filipino food and culture. The customers, they kept coming back here and they embrace the food. So where we, uh, I'm so very thankful for their support. Oh gosh, it's bringing back memories. Look, I had sworn off carbohydrates till I went. I'm all about the lumpia now. My body weight is currently 80% lumpia. Check that place out. Uh, David Sandberg, doctor, how are you? I am great. Good to be here. Uh, Mr. Mayor, you've been mayor. You, you rotate. Rancho is interesting in that it rotates about every year. You've been mayor five cycles, right? That's right. Yeah, we were begun as a city in 2002. And so we celebrated 20 years just recently. And this is my fifth term as mayor. And I'm not overhyping it. This city really has made some great decisions that help it become a big city and help it grow in the right way. Absolutely. And it wasn't just Fiesta Philippines, which is a great place. Yeah, a lot of places. Absolutely. Uh, we have seen so much growth in Ranch Cordova and so much reinvention of what we were uh, and what, frankly, what it means to be a suburb because we now have a lot of urban benefits and urban sort of facilities that people can enjoy and enhance their quality of life right here in Rancho Cordova. And you know, there are city leaders that often say they, they, they preach diversity. And of course we want that, but they're not really doing things. Well, proof is in Rancho Cordova. If you look at the population, both businesses, who owns them, who goes to them, who lives here, this truly is a modern, diverse American city you should be proud of. Oh, absolutely. I think nationally we are ranked 17th as the most, 17th most diverse community in the United States. And that's reflected in a lot of what we do. You know, we have an international festival, we have Kids Day, we have a, the largest 4th of July celebration you'll ever see in your life right here in Rancho Cordova. And it's because we celebrate ourselves. And also, there's an organization of city leaders nationwide. And look, you should give yourself credit. You're too humble to say so. But please explain the national organization that you're a part of. So the National League of Cities represents 19,000 cities, towns, and villages all across the United States. I've been involved since we were elected trying to figure out what do I do to improve this place, Rancho Cordova, and this year I'm serving as its president. Got it. So uh, not that this is a commercial for Rancho Cordova, but again, I do love this city. It is our around town today. So Mr. Mayor, say, come to Rancho Cordova because... Come to Ranch Cordova because we are the fun place. <laughs> you are a fun place. Lots going on here. Thank, Thank you very you. much for all that you do. I love Rancho Cordova. Uh, speaking of fun, do you mind if I promote something really quick? Go for it. What are you doing at 930 today? Will you hang out with me to watch my new show? Oh, you have an exciting new show. I can't wait. I'm going to have to tape it because I have another fun thing I have to do. That, that's okay. I'm, I'm going to bring you a DVR. I'm going to install a DVR for you. It's called Take a Look. 9.30 today, Millie Bobby Brown, one of the most influential young people in the world, is my guest, Mark Wahlberg, and a lot of other people. And the dog that's in Mark Wahlberg's movie that Mark will even tell you is a much better actor. Take a look, 9.30, and take a look at Rancho Cordova when you can. <laughs> and more importantly than anything, have a great weekend, and get this home. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, the mayor having a lot of fun today. Yeah. It's, it's fun to be mayor. I want to watch Take a Look from the Dream Home. So if I can come in and just sit on that nice couch and enjoy it and enjoy the home, <laughs> that would be great. All right. Maximum 